Hi, friends. <laughs> That's right, y'all. You know we gotta hit this up, but first, intro. Yo, what's good guys? It is your boy Jason JV saying welcome to another reaction video. And yes, yes, y'all, it's been a while since we hit up a Adam Calhoun uh, vlog video. And uh, so you know we gotta hit up this one. This one being called Elon Musk in Twitter. So yeah, for those of you who may not know, if you've been hiding under a rock or something, I don't know. But uh, for those of you who may not be aware, Elon Musk did buy Twitter. And uh, when I got word that it was confirmed that he had officially bought Twitter. Well, guess who went and swooped in on uh, four shares for Twitter? This guy right here. <laughs> I'm saying, man. Hey, look. Tesla shares are worth uh, $998 a piece last time I checked. Twitter shares are worth around 50 bucks a piece. Now that Elon owns it, I mean, I'm saying, I'm saying, get in where you fit in because months from now, a year from now, with uh, with Elon at the wheel, who knows how high those shares are going to go up to. I'm just saying, man. Uh, but anyway, <laughs> let's go ahead and get right into this vlog video with my man, A-Cal. Once again, this is called Elon Musk and Twitter. Without further ado, I'd like to hear here. Go. Hi, friends. Elon Musk <laughs> bought Twitter. And, and by the way, hi, friend. <laughs> and guess who's mad about it? White people. Not just any white people. White liberals. Yep. America. Oh, my God. The same people that get mad about literally anything. It's called... Facts, man. They get mad at you for breathing. Let's go. Called freedom of speech. You guys hate that, don't you? Who are you going to report it to now? Your mom. Mm -hmm. That's who. Your mom. Yep. You can't report it to Twitter because nobody cares. See, the problem is... Kind of reminds me of that that old Tech 9 song where he goes, ain't no, ain't no running to your mama when you're caught up in a drama for that sana sana. Da -da 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 -da. Or actually, no, that, that's actually my, my remix. <laughs> uh, it actually goes, uh, ain't, ain't no running to your mama when you're caught up in the drama. Ain't no running to your mama when you're caught up in the drama because you bring nobody on her. Bruh, let's go. They gave you social media as kind of like a pacifier. So you guys could say whatever you want and go crazy on social media. And no one could respond to you without getting reported, blocked, and deleted. So now you guys are like, wait, they're going to be able to say whatever they want back to me? No, that's not. What if they take it too far with freedom of speech? It's Facts. That's exactly how they're behaving right now. They, they want it so they can have all the freedom, right? They can say whatever they want. Can nobody challenge them? But now... Now, you know, everybody is going to have free speech. You know what I'm saying? Elon is not going to discriminate against anyone. He is all for free speech for all Americans that's going to be on this platform, which means there is no censorship no more. No one will be censored. And these dummies on the left fail to realize that, hey, just because the right's no longer going to be censored, guess what? You're not going to be censored either. You can still say all the dumb shit you want to say all you want. It's fine. But guess what? The right also have the same right as you to say whatever you want. And they're like, yeah, see, people people like Elon Musk shouldn't shouldn't own Twitter because that's just that's just too much power for, for, for one person. Well, you didn't have uh, any issues with the uh, original owner owning it because oh yeah, because he, he, he only favored you, but um well, sorry, but ain't nobody gonna be um you know, powdering your 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 uh, behinds anymore. You know what I'm saying? So, yeah. Sorry, not sorry, but see, um, Twitter needs to make money in order for it to survive. And with y'all having total run of Twitter, yeah. You know the old saying: get woke, go broke. Yeah. Anyway. It's, it's words. They're, they're words. This is what we've been dealing with. I'm preaching yeah, out here. I'm preaching truth. No. And I'm speaking up for babies. I don't want to hear. And, and see, see, it's it, it, it's people like that. That is the reason why Twitter needs to be regulated. And thankfully, that's what e Elon Musk is fixing to do. So, yeah, scream all you want. 
Ain't nobody, ain't nobody gonna hear you. You guys, you're the same people that are trying to push uh, like sexual orientation and talking about this type of things to like kindergartners. And it Facts. All these things, right? All this stuff about what people do, you know, in the privacy of their bedrooms. They're trying, they're trying to push that onto our kids. You know what I'm saying? And I don't understand why they, they, they don't think, oh, you know, yeah, we, we probably shouldn't be teaching kids like that because, you know, heterosexuals don't be teaching heterosexuality to kids. No. What happens behind closed doors, regardless of what your sexual orientation is, kids do not need to know about it until they're of age. And then when they're of age, then they can make the uh, decision as to who they want to be with. You know what I mean? So leave the kids alone. If you get mad about people saying bad... There needs to be a saying um, in regards to kids' innocence. How about um, kids' innocence matter? How about that? Things about pedophiles, you're the problem. And there's no cure for... Facts. Facts. Thankfully, uh, well, at least hopefully, this platform will no longer be protecting these uh, these um, cuties fans, well, as, as we'll, 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 be, we'll be calling them. You know what I'm saying? Bruh. Grown adults preying on small children. Well, yep. there's one. But anyway, back to freedom <clears throat> of speech. Old guys like me, we don't have to figure out what these little abbreviation acronyms mean. We can just say it. What's FJB mean? Fatty Ghibli bits? Fatty Jiggly boop? No, it means, you know what it means. <laughs> See, social media has given you guys the false sense that you are the majority when really you're like 1%. You voting for Joe Biden, you guys made more Democrats turn into Republicans than any time in American history. And that is no exaggeration. Have you seen Joe Biden's approval rating as of late? That sucker is tanking. I mean, he is, he is the worst president of the United States in today's modern day history. Bruh, no exaggeration. You want to see what Joe Joe Biden's approval rate be looking like, man, Google it. Google is your best friend. I'm telling you. Numbers do not lie, right? Let's go. We never have to deal with Joe Biden being president again. Actually, we never have to deal with a Democrat being president again for probably two decades. And if you have a problem... Facts. Don't, don't be surprised if Trump decides to run again and he wins by a landslide. Don't be surprised if that happens. I'm not saying it's going to happen. I'm just saying if it does, don't be surprised. Bruh. Figuring out whether you're for me or Trump and you ain't black. So on behalf of... I'm sorry, Joe. Can, can you repeat that again? Mayor Trump and you ain't black. So I'm one more time. If you have a problem figuring out whether you're for me or Trump and you ain't black. So on behalf That's who y'all voted for. And you want to call other people racist? I'm just I'm just saying. I'm just saying. Half of a lot of freedom loving Americans. <laughs> Buckle up. It ain't gonna be fun for you when they turn the volume up on real Americans. Facts. Facts. My man here is spitting nothing but straight facts in this vlog. Definitely gonna mash the thumbs up for this one. And uh, yeah, if y'all are with this one, y'all know what to do with that link. That'll be in the video description down below. And yeah, man. I'm with uh, ACAL on this 100%, man. Watch Twitter. I'm, I'm saying, I'm saying, you know... For one of the the uh, richest men uh, in in the country, if not the world, uh, bruh, to for for him, you know, we work, wherever that dude goes, that's where the money is. I, I'm saying, if if you were smarter to invest in Tesla stocks, man, man, you must be living that life. I'm just saying. And uh, for those of you who may have bought Twitter stocks, and you're thinking about selling it, well. It it, it it might be a dumb move to do. I'm just saying because, like I said, man, I'm not gonna tell y'all what what to do with your money. Y'all y'all do what you want with your money at the end of the day. I'm just saying, I'm just saying you might want to consider investing in Twitter now that Elon owns it because who knows where where the the value of these stocks are gonna be. Let's say five months from now or a year from now. You know what I mean, I'm saying, man, you best get in while you can. Bruh. Anyways, y'all.
gonna be some exciting times. I can't wait to see where where Twitter's gonna go. You know what I mean? As far as um, it being under new new ownership, um, is it, it, it's gonna be a wild ride. It, I can't wait to see how things are just gonna just gonna go on the platform. Um, I know some people are already leaving. There's some celebrities that are thinking about leaving because Elon owns it now and. Hey, I don't care. I say, yeah, root out all those, all those who claim to be about, you know, freedom, who claim to be about, you know, free speech, but really they're not. They're they're pro censorship. Yeah, let let those pro censorship, those pro cancel culture vultures, take their leave. You know what I'm saying, bruh, bruh. It's like the old saying goes: you can't stand the heat, get your ass out of the kitchen. I'm just saying. Anyways, y'all, if you guys are with this reaction. Make sure that you guys are liking, commenting, subscribing, all that good stuff. That would be greatly appreciated. Um, don't forget to check out, of course, all the links in the video description down below, including the uh, store links. That will also be greatly appreciated. You know what I mean? Hopefully, you guys will pick up a piece of merch or two. I do have two samples coming in that I will be rocking uh, as soon as they get here. You know what I'm saying? So I can help promote my stuff. And uh, yeah. And also, don't forget to check out all the channel links for all of my fan bam that I rock with here on this platform. Uh, that'll also be greatly appreciated. And uh, yeah, till the next one, y'all have a blessed one. All right, peace.